Hello, I'm Nicola McCarthy. It's Wednesday, the 26th of February. Welcome to City Today. Well, it's not every day you bump into a Hollywood actor, but that's exactly what happened here today at Carrington. Actor and comedian Kevin Hart is in town promoting his new movie, Ride Along, and we caught up with him as he received a tour of the training facilities before meeting the squad and trying his luck against Joe Hart. Yo, Kevin Hart, Manchester City, I'm at the, I'm at the stadium. Well, we're here with Kevin Hart, who's just uh, arrived at the Carrington Training Ground after the stadium. Kevin, how's yes. your trip been so far? It's amazing. This has been amazing. Uh, going to both uh, both facilities has been pretty dope. I haven't seen anything like this, so it's my first time really embracing football. Uh, I guess you can say in this in this way, and it's been massive. Yeah, That's you my, enjoyed it? My UK word. <laughs> yeah, it's been massive. Massive. So are you a football fan, or is this... Uh, uh, no, I'm interest? going to be honest, I'm not. But this nope. has made me want to watch the game more and kind of made me, you know, want to just want to know more about it. Like, I'm familiar with the players, and, yeah. you know, uh, I know how much money they make. Yeah. Uh, that definitely has made me interested. Uh, <laughs> made me want to go and kick a football myself or get started up in this sport. Uh, but for for the most part, I'm not aware of it, uh, you know, as much as I should be. So I need to I need to learn more about it. Have you got any skills? Uh, no. What I can do is kick a ball over a fence by accident. <laughs> I don't know if you know it or not, but that's an actual talent. That because is a talent. You tell yeah. me to kick it in the goal, I'm going to really attempt to, but it's going to go over a fence. <laughs> It's a pleasure, man. Yeah, you too. Sorry to take y'all away from practice, oh, don't dude. Be silly, man. Get over there, y'all got a big game. Don't worry about me. All right. I, I, just, think... I just want to say hi, man. Things yeah. are good. Yeah. Me, going up against world-known Joe Hart, aka my cousin. Okay, <laughs> aka my cousin, oh, Manchester oh, City, oh. the best goalie in the game right now. Yo, I suggest you, I suggest you brace yourself, Joe. Okay. But you know what it is? Yeah. Football players recognize other football players. So, you know, they probably respect the fact that uh, we all share the same talent. I just chose to go the comedic route, you know, but I definitely could have did this and been a part of this team. And that's what this is about. Yep, look at this, man. That's my brother right there on my white side. Right there. <laughs> I appreciate it, man. Obviously, you're a city fan now. That's uh, that yes. Without saying, yeah. Yes, I am. Good. Yes, I am. Good. I am massive over here. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and you're going to take city, city back. To you know Philadelphia, what? I'm actually to going to. I'm actually going to go and not only embrace what I've seen here, but go spread the word Excellent. of why we need to get on board. Yeah. That way, when I come back, I'm gonna know more. Because right now, the sport I get over here is unreal. You know, yes. they love me over here. Um, so what I'm gonna do is take that love, <laughs> spread it, bop, go back over it works there. Both ways. Yeah, you go. That's there what it's all it. about. Well, the countdown to Wembley continues and every day this week we've been bringing you a selection of player previews. Today we've been talking to Samir Nasri, who's in a confident mood ahead of Sunday's clash with Sunderland. We lost there uh, in, the, in the league. They just lose 4-1 at Arsenal, so it's, it will never be an easy game. It's a final, every final is difficult, so, you know. I'm, but I'm confident that if we play our football, that we respect Sunderland, we're going to win the game. You have to, to approach it like any other games, but as a competitor you know that there is something different. There is a trophy there, right there, and you have to play it like any other cup game. Because it's not like the league. The league you can afford to lose a point there and there, and you know that you have ten other games to, to go back. Cup is not the same, you have to be there at, <clears throat> at the S&T and be there from the, from the start. So, you know, it's the same approach, but as a competitor, you know that you cannot miss your game. We're all excited to win the first trophy of the season because it's a final, it's the Carlin Cup, and uh, we want to we wanna win it. It's a big day for the EDS, who are in Spain ahead of their under-19 UEFA Youth League clash with Atletico Madrid. 
The game kicks off at 7pm UK time tonight and although there's no live coverage, you can follow all the match action on Twitter and of course the full match report, post-match reaction and highlights will follow. Finally, there's been some bad news for City women today, with Karen Bardsley and Danielle Lee both sustaining long-term injuries, which will more than likely rule them out of the start of the Super League season. More details on their conditions can be found on the official website, and of course we wish them a speedy recovery. Well, that's all for today, but if you haven't already seen it, why not check out our video with City legend Dennis Stewart, who looks back at that unforgettable League Cup win back in 1976. We'll be back tomorrow. See you then.